people have closed their eyes and done meditation for years and not gone anywhere. In fact, when I hear stories of people, we got Nam, we got initiated so many years ago and we haven't had any experiences. And I say, this is strange. Why didn't you check it out? Who initiated you? A master, perfect living master. Why didn't you get hold of him? Master, what's this teaching? If you don't succeed in an ordinary class in a school and you fail, you can't be failing all the time. You want to do something to study and get, get out of it and pass. How come you can fail for years and years on a path which you have been instructed what to do and then you are still satisfied and saying, okay, I have been doing my duty but I have seen nothing. How will you go to home if you have not made any step inward? And why haven't you questioned the master, the teacher who taught you how to meditate? Why don't you question him? Well, then they say, well, it's very difficult to meet the teacher. It's very difficult to see my teacher, my master has died. My master was, had so many followers. I couldn't meet them anyway. I couldn't get, put this question to my master. I said, but who told you to go to the physical form of the master? The master didn't initiate you physically. How does a perfect living master initiate a seeker? He doesn't see, initiate outside. He initiates inside. That means people haven't understood the meaning of initiation. If they have been initiated for years and years and they are still thinking that the master is outside. The master by initiating you has placed himself inside you. You may not see him for a while, but that doesn't matter. The truth is, the master is inside you and not outside. That's the difference. All of the teachers are outside. The perfect living master is inside you. Therefore, if you are initiated by a perfect living master, you have the master with you all the time inside. Therefore, the questions have to be put to the master inside and not outside. If you can put your questions, your complaints, your crying, to the master inside, that's worthwhile. Because the master is there, is hearing you, listening to you, and will take care of you. But if you don't even ask him inside, and only think that the master was outside, he is gone, or I can't see him, or he's too far away, then you don't get any answers, and you remain outward. Bharmukhi, like great master would say, you we remain Bharmukhi, that you don't go within, you have to go within to get all the answers, including answers from your own master. So when I see, and people tell me they have initiated for a long time and they haven't had any success, it bothers me that how could this happen? Because I have seen people who followed the simple instructions of the master that they were able to achieve something. They, when they were not able to achieve, they went back to the master, they did something. Master said, go within. Talk to me there. 